Now, crippled by a shortage of fi firefighters, the Austin Fire Department actually failed to reach a critical response time goal. That's according to a report we got our hands on that was released last month. Eight minutes to a life-threatening incident, that's the national average. And Austin firefighters say they do reach that mark, but 85% of the time. Now, a fire station in southwest Austin is impacting those times, and it's impacting them for the better. KXAN's Gigi Barnett is live with the details. Good morning, David. Well, the Austin Fire Department officially took over this fire station here at Shady, Shady Hollow. Uh, last month, with a major grand opening, the pre-existing building was once part of the Man Shack Fire Department. Well, the, the Austin Police Department, Fire Department said that it needed this fire station because it needed to release some of the workload from the other two nearby fire stations, and already it is making a big impact. Now, a report recently released revealed that AFD got to 911 calls within eight minutes, 85% of the time. Last year, it had a goal of reaching the same calls 88% of the time, but the department fell short of that goal by 3%. Firefighters blamed Austin's bumper to bumper traffic and the growth of the city's borders, which makes the distance to emergencies farther. Add in the shortage of firefighters, and the department is simply stretched. One solution, though, is more fire stations, and the Shady Hollow one is opened up four years early, and another one in South Austin is on the way in just two years. AFD says it's already seeing times to emergencies in the Shady Hollow district go down. What we don't like to do is take a small sample size of data, so it's been less than a month that this station has been open, but the all indications are that it's making a difference. And AFD says its goal now is to get closer to the national average of emergencies response times, which is uh, eight minutes and 90% of its 911 calls. David, back to you. Gigi, thanks. 835 now, and we were just saying how that neighborhood is actually kind of where they've done uh, some of the fire mitigation steps. And even yeah. though we haven't had any bad fires here, thankfully, uh, we've seen fires in other parts of the state burn 500 acres just in the past week. Yeah, wow. it's important.